in uh, this last video we'll just gonna play a bit around I'm gonna try to build a house and explain how I'm thinking so just uh, follow and get some uh, inspiration um, if I'm building a house I usually prefer to build uh, separate walls and uh, this is very smart if you're planning to have uh, a lot of windows and complex shapes because it's easier to go back and change one small wall than if you create one big solid. Uh, another thing that's very smart is to use the copy function because to drag a new uh, cube and make that exactly as high as uh, the other wall it's uh, quite difficult so much smarter to just uh, copy if you have something that you want to be uh, of similar height and thickness. Uh, what we're doing here basically is just moving around the different uh, um, yeah, use the rotation tool and use the move tool and I'm just gonna make a few um, walls here until I'm happy with my house. Maybe I'm gonna make this a bit further and move this to the back and like this and maybe I want this to be wider because I can do like this hmm maybe I have one area of the house going a bit further than the other like this and then I can copy the last wall here so I see that the, the last part here is a bit tricky where you have to sort of find the perfect match between um, final walls uh, especially since the uh, scaling tool is scaling to both sides oh I did the global scaling there I'm gonna undo it so I'm gonna oh, again um, do I'm just gonna scale this and there I'm happy uh, I'm going to hit save. I'm going to hide the outlines. Uh, the outline is all the lines showing where the object starts and ends. And it's uh, good sometimes, but uh, when I'm building this house, I want it clean and simple. I'm going to add a roof. Uh, it's going to look like, yeah, let me think. I think it's going to look like this. I want it this way and I want it to cover the whole si long side of the house. So I'm just going to stretch it in different directions. I'm going to place it so it's uh, just above the house and pull it down. You can see if I pull it too far down you can see here that the roof is coming up I don't want that but to place it a bit over is, is good just so we have a clear overlapping and I, now co I copied it and I'm gonna make a similar one just a lot shorter and I'm gonna place this in the middle of my house maybe do it a bit more narrow and I'm gonna move that all the way in like this so that the roof is um, meeting each other so that there's no room for uh, any rain uh, coming in I can make it a bit lower since it's a smaller part of the house and um, yeah then it's maybe time to put on some um, materials I want uh, 
my house to be made of bricks. Since I've made the four different walls, I need to paint each side. Here I can see that I've not enclosed um, the roof over my um, uh, walls, so I need to make sure it's always big enough for all the sides. Uh, and for the roof, I'd like some um, stone roof, uh, but I also want some solar panels because I have a very environmentally friendly house. Uh, what I did wrong here was I was painting, I wanted to paint only that little square, but I painted the whole thing. So I need to undo, do it again, and only paint that small thing. So now I can have a solar panel on my roof. I hope this is uh, directed towards the right direction in relation to the sun. If I want to create, uh, for example, a window, this is why it's smart to use uh, unique walls every side, because here I can now paint a uh, window. I can use the uh, extrusion tool and just make a hole in the wall. And I could uh, now place a window in that. So I'm just going to make it a bit bigger than the hole. I'm going to paint it in glass material. That's not glass and that's also not the right paint tool. And I'm just going to move that where the hole is. So you can see there it is. And there I have a glass window. Save again, and uh, you can do this. Uh, you, can, you can also start if you want to make, for example, interior. I would suggest you maybe remove, uh, maybe even remove the roof as well. So you remove these three, so you can get some more access to what's inside, and you can just move it back on. Uh, so this is uh, just a simple uh, beginning to how to start to make a house, how you can think and hope you create something much nicer than what I did here. Thank you very much.